Hi, I'm BrainFreeze9876 and welcome to the next part of Horizon Zero Dawn, uh, episode 2, episode 1 of the non-tutorial. And, well, in this episode, we're finally going to be able to get on with it. Get on with it! Yes! Get on with it! He said we'd go hunting this morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? What's he doing up there? He's just standing there. What's going on with him? Yeah, any what, any one of these yellow like things is like a clearly marked handhold. Because it's gotta be made obvious or else you'll never find it. Aloy, you're here. Did you want to be alone? No. We must speak. But I've been thinking about your training, Aloy. You've learned to hunt, learned to survive. But I fear there's a lesson I failed to teach you. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll always learn what you have to teach. There has been some trouble recently. It affords an opportunity to learn this lesson, but it will be dangerous. You must come prepared, or you will die. Descend into the embrace and hunt until you have gathered the parts for fire arrows. Fire arrows? What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? At the edge of the embrace? Yes. Now be on your way. Is something else bothering you? No. I'm fine. Anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the embrace? Oh, uh, Odd Grotta might be out of food by now. You could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time. <sighs> Wouldn't mind if she'd say thanks just once. <sighs> Grotta follows the law. Her science towards us is honorable, not an insult. If you say so. Are you worrying about what happens after the proving? What happens is clear. You will be accepted as one of the tribe, and I will still be an outcast. To be shunned. Rost, even if the tribe accepts me, I won't... There is much to do, Aloy. We will discuss this later. <sighs> okay. I'll go gather the parts, but I'm also going to pay Karst a visit. Aloy, that man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. <sighs> and I'm glad he does. I want to buy a trip caster, and no other trader will sell to outcasts. Stock it with ammunition, then. You'll find use for that weapon tonight. That sounds ominous. All right, see you at the North Gate. Of course, conveniently timed alarm is convenient. <laughs> All right. Uh, yep. And so now we finally get to go down to the, to the world below. Because we're at a pretty high spot right now. But first, we're gonna zip line! Jack of Rock! Okay, press. Now, here's the map. Here's a square. Where a site where machines gather called a scrapper. I'm gonna actually turn that off just because I feel if there's I might turn it on from time to time, but but if if there's like there's it just clutters the map too much, I think, otherwise, or especially later on in the game. Alright, uh, and then. We're gonna have to, to choose these skills. Okay. What do I want to do? Of 
for now, we're gonna... Oh, it... Oh, he's gonna do the healing. <laughs> because, yeah, I'm gonna bot it up a lot, and... Of course, auto shut down and... Ah, sometimes I don't like the, these headsets. But first... Hunt for blaze and shards. Talk to Carson, trade for a tripcaster. I'm gonna open up the the errand. Cause it's not even it doesn't even get to be called a side quest. It's the errand where we gotta talk to crazy old woman. And hunt I guess hunt some meat. I embrace. My whole life I've never gone beyond this valley. That'll change after the proving. Two days. Two days until I get answers. Two days and I'll know who she was. And why I was cast out at birth. As if there could be an excuse for that. But anyways, let's just make our way to Ald Grata and skip ahead a moment. Get on with it! And we're here. When my name was called to the mountain, you did not speak it back. You kept it close to your heart. I know, even when my belly and hands are empty, that you hold me in your embrace. <laughs> Anyone else notice that? <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Hello, Grotta. Oh, mother. Since I was cast out. Have I not been constant as the river flows? Have I not kept the vows as the stones do? Show me your grace, O oh mother. And provide for me once more. Don't worry, Grotta. I'll hunt your rabbits. Oh, mother. I hear your voice on the wind. I would count your blessings on my prayer beads, but I lost them atop the eastern overlook. My old bones are too worn to return. So it's rabbits and your trinket you need this time. Okay, we'll find you at your camp. There. So yeah. It's the usual standard fetch quest, which it's the beginning of the game, so we'll we'll do it. We'll take it, I guess. But yeah, gotta hunt some wildlife. Where is some wildlife, anyways? And make sure this is actually what we need. Oh, gather meat. Yeah, the funny thing about this game. The wildlife is slow. So, yeah, you can just run up and whack. It's like practically weasel stomping day here up in this game. If you don't know what that song is, <laughs> you should search it. It's by Weird Al. Yeah, <laughs> it's definitely worth a listen. Okay. Also gotta go up in this direction. Might need that. Stupid controller. Ah. Blinded by the light. Oh, what? No way. I, I call BS on that. Yeah. He 
yeah, since I have the dynamic cut on, the the my health bar only appears when I, I either here. take damage, go into a fight, or uh, <laughs> or touch the direct uh, the touchpad. But I or like graze the touchpad. Also, I got a weapon modification, so now I can go put it on my th uh, bow. Yeah, right now, uh, in a handy dandy trophy. Yes, I know, we know, Konzo will like that. But anyways, yeah, you can put mods or weapon, uh, they're called coils, but they're just little, <laughs> they might as well be stickers. <laughs> like on South, South Park, the stick of truth. But right now, uh, you can't take them back out. And if you want to put another one on over the same slot, it'll erase this coil. But later on, or once you get enough skill points, you can unlock unlock something that can. That allows you to reuse weapon modifications. And that, I think, will be important enough for us to go through. But on to it. Yeah, get it. Oh wait, that's a goose. It'll fly away if I... Yes! <laughs> Uh, Peter is not gonna like me. Yeah, there's enough. There's enough for, or there's enough wildlife around for now. Maybe not when I'm done with the game, but. <laughs> I guess there's just a whole bunch of rabbits here, huh? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> okay, Grata said her prayer beads were at the Eastern Overlook. Not far from here. Oh, and here's something. Basically, I can get extra shards by selling talismans. Also, you can use uh, meat, the meats, <laughs> Arby's. We got the meats. Anyways, uh, you can use meat to craft potions. All right, let's see if I can, I can whack another rabbit before, by, before we're done with this. Uh. No, come on. <laughs> See how slow and dumb these rabbits are? That's like, it's sort of immersion breaking. <laughs> that they're that slow and in this game. It like to me anyway. So much for being careful. The brave trail up the rocks is close. Bye. Eh, let's not worry about that one. I guess I got no choice what to worry about on now. Ah, <laughs> all right, very, very nice. Where the hell is this thing? Yeah, over, over here. Yeah, the game sort of like locks on to those like rails, so you don't actually feel like you have to be pit like pixel perfect. So yeah, like you know how there's these more natural looking ledges in addition to the to the artificial yellow looking 
rails and pegs and <laughs> it's just it's just me and it might be nitpicky but I prefer those to to the or I prefer the these natural looking ledges to uh, <laughs> what can't I word today I, I I'm just out of practice I'm like a, a, a monk who's like taking a vow of silence t trying to stream, <laughs> do a Twitch stream for the first time. <laughs> Let's hear you say zipline! Zipline! Shakabra! This looks promising. Ah, if only I could have capped those ge geese. Aha! Uh -huh. Brought his prayer beads. I see why she comes up here to pray. It looks out to Mother's Gate. You know, I wonder what bothers me more. That she ignores me, or that with all her talking to all mothers, she's never lonely. Alright, we got the beads. We got the meat. What are they hunting out there? Beyond the embrace. It can't be just one machine. W let's make our way back. Going down fast. I'm over. I can I gotta deal with this. You want to talk to an outcast? I'm desperate for help. Whatever the consequences. What's the problem then? Trouble with your leg? Forget about me. It's my daughter, Arana. She's in danger. She went after a scrapper near Mother's Cradle, and I fear for her life. I can't even stand up, let alone go after her. Will you help me find her? You know the matriarchs might cast you out for speaking to me, don't you? I don't care. I tried looking for her myself and my leg gave out. Just find her. Why would your daughter hunt a scrapper on her own? It's my fault. I went after it first and it tore up my leg. I barely got away and I left a spear impaled in the machine. That spear was made by Adina, my mate, who died last year. It means everything to Arana. She, she went after the scrapper to get it back. You said Arana went to Mother's Cradle? Yes, southeast of here. I forbid her from going, but ever since her mother died, she's become impossible. Damn it, look at me. A widower, now a cripple. Father that can't find his daughter. Please, help me set things right. I'll do what I can to help your daughter. Make sure she's all right. I'm begging you. Mm. Maybe next episode. I think I'm going to call it here. This has been Brain Freeze 9876 hoping you had a decent enough time with this episode. And... How does Gonzo do it? Well, remember, like, ch uh, subscribe, and... Okay. You know what? Alright, it ends. <laughs>